hey guys welcome back so guys in this video we are continuing about our vb.net project so guys now as we are continuing our admin dashboard now we will be seeing in this video about order things okay so what and all things we have order we are going to show a report generation for that so main let's get started with it so first let's double click on this button order and let's tell that a order dot show function so we want to create one order page so i'm giving a unique name a order dot show function to show that so let's create that page right click on your project add windows form and now let's paste that a orders dot vb let's add here our page is created and now this will be link to your orders page and now guys let us design a simple format to show the our report generation of your orders so let's save this and yes guys first let's um, go to our toolbox toolbox and let's search for label one select and tell label name report generation of orders let's give the font size to 16 pixel and make it bold let's save and now guys over here now let's select data grid view to view all the or show all the report of your table so guys now let us click on this and just drag till here as simple and now guys here at the top corner of your data grid view you can see a small arrow so let's click on that now guys just click on this drop down and add project data source let's click on this and go to database click next data set next and then this will be your database name okay and click on next over here you will be able to see all your tables so let me just see over here we have to select this data this table let us select with the orders table only one and yes guys so let's leave default itself and let's finish this finish it's done so guys you can see all the fields over here when you execute that okay so let's save this and now guys let us execute let me just unpin that save all the files and let's start let's go to admin login with at gmail.com one two three four five six login okay you can see that orders so let's click on orders you can see that all the report of report generation of your order data has come okay so guys let us book one more order and let's view that data so let's close this close this page stop the project and yes guys let's start again so now let us book one order place a order with at gmail.com one two three four five six login now you have logged in okay so let's select this mobile and i want this red mi with the quantity three let's buy now enter your details so with prakash and email with at gmail.com phone number address okay state pin code and the payment mode i want to select cash done and this is my product details whatever it shown let's place order your order has been placed okay we are on the thank you page 
so done so let's close this and yep guys so let's log in once again to check that admin dashboard our order is placed or not let's start the project login gmail oops make it all small letter two three four five six login now okay so let's click on orders over here you can see that just now we have placed this order so right now it, before it was not there this order id number four you can see that so guys we have successfully completed how to make a report generation of your table in vb.net so guys let's continue next video about new topic something like feedbacks and much more so guys thank you for watching this video please subscribe like and share